Hello. Okay, so um, I used to do keto and um, I, I stopped. I mean, I, I still do low carb and I'm, you know, pretty much sugar free, but um, I, you know, you still get sugar in here and there. It's, it's impossible. It's just, you know, it's, 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 it's even in your alcohol. <laughs> so anyway, um, but one of the things that I, um, I, I enjoyed doing um, was I used to make these um, like, they're called like keto, um, I can't remember what they're called anyway, like keto balls. And, and you, there's something sweet that you can make and um, it, they're kind of healthy. You can put protein powder and, you know, stuff in there. And, um, you know, it also gives you that feeling like you've had, you know, something sweet, which I'm not a big sweets person, but, um, you know, anyway, long story short, this um, another thing I, 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 you know, when I was growing up for Christmas, my mom always made these chocolate bourbon balls and it was just part of Christmas. And I know I was only allowed like, you know, one bourbon ball and, you know, maybe I'd go and sneak another one like here and there. Cause there's, you know, had bourbon, a little bit of bourbon in there and they're chocolate and they're so good. Anyway, this is my version today of, um, chocolate bourbon balls, um, a little bit healthier instead of vanilla wafers I'm using. Uh, honey graham crackers, um, and then I'm going to um, tie that in with like those keto things because I'm going to throw in some um, instead of regular powdered sugar, I'm using like the swerve and then um, the cocoa powder. Um, but then I'm going to put in like a little bit of my collagen and a little flax and chia. And um, instead of corn syrup, I'm using agave, and so um, you know. We'll see, right? So anyway, started off, I've, I've ground up some of the uh, graham crackers. Uh, and let's see, we're gonna put a little uh, cocoa powder. And um, I'm gonna do some of that swerve powdered sugar. Okay. And I'm gonna use my hand to break it up because I just want it to be, you know, you wanna make sure like you don't have any chunks in there. Uh, right, so, um, yeah, before you add your wet, just make sure you get all that mixed together. And then, you know, you just wanna taste it and make sure it tastes right. You could also put nuts like chopped nuts and stuff uh walnuts that'd be kind of cool um i eat my nuts throughout the day so i'm sure i've you know anyway then um you're gonna let these put them in an airtight container and let them sit for like a couple days to like really get the you know the most out of the flavor and then um because they'll you know they'll get richer and then before you, um, and you wanna roll them in that powdered sugar. And then before you, um, you know, put them out, you wanna roll them again in powdered sugar. So that, I don't know, that's how we did it. You could also roll them, I guess, like in, um, you know, bless you, something else. Okay. So, um, oh, and I'm gonna add some um, blacks. You don't have to do all that, but you know, I like to get my ch chia and my flax in anywhere I can. And um, I do my, I like to wear the patches on the collagen, but you know, I have a lot of this collagen powder um, still. protein powder I just realized so I've got a little protein powder in there too I was like man that collagen is weird today <laughs> I'd stuck my protein my keto protein powder in there so anyway I guess it's, these really are like turning into keto balls all right um all right some more mixing um yeah, and these are, you know, the kind of things that, you know, make sure you wash your hands and all that first because you are going to be using your hands to make the little balls and um, to, to crush everything up, okay? Uh, let's see. All right, here's 
finished my agave. Sometimes this, oops. Yeah, and you just want like, you know, a few tablespoons of that, we'll see. I'll add more if it needs it. Okay, let's check that out. Yeah, that's my bourbon. This is my favorite bourbon. See, it's called 1792. Single barrel, small batch, I like it. It's a good evening sipping bourbon. Like I said, you know, just let them sit for a couple days because they do get a lot stronger after a couple days. Don't you don't want to? Yeah, I'm. And I, I remember, you know, a couple years ago I tasted it first and I was like, mm, I think it could be a little bit more bourbon. <laughs> and then after a couple days I was like, oh, they got so strong. Anyway, we'll see. Um, I'll let you know in a couple days if they're perfect. But that's it. In the refrigerator, a couple days. Bourbon balls. Merry Christmas. <laughs>